Hi, I'm Gary, this is Olga and it's nice to see you in another video on our OG Crypto channel. Today we will introduce you to a project called Synthetify, which is a decentralized exchange based on Solana. With Synthetify you can buy, trade and make money with your cryptocurrencies. Today we will discuss this entire project starting with what it actually is, the features it offers such as staking, trading, liquidation and about its advantages. However, before we get into actual part of this video, I would like to remind you to leave a thumb up. Additionally, I encourage you to subscribe to the channel to stay up to date with all the news on the OG Crypto channel. Let's get started. Synthetify is an upcoming synthetic assets platform fully built on the Solana blockchain. The platform aims to provide a bridge between cryptocurrencies, stocks, fiat currencies and other financial instruments directly from one decentralized exchange. Synthetify solves critical problems seen on other synthetic assets platforms like high fees, long confirmation times and losses caused by arbitrage during sharp market moves. The Solana blockchain offers better performance, that is orders of magnitude better than any other layer 1 blockchain available on the market right now. Thanks to low fees and the fast confirmation time is the perfect bedrock for applications like Synthetify. Synthetify will introduce its own token that will act as collateral for synthetic assets, reduce fees on Synthetify and hold voting power during governance decisions. Decentralized Finance, also known as DeFi, is a monetary system that was built on public blockchains and most importantly, enables financial activity to take place without any involvement of centralized institutions. Currently, the overwhelming majority of DeFi are applications built on Ethereum or other EVM-compatible blockchains. This causes Ethereum to be slow and unreasonably expensive to use. The idea behind DeFi is to give the same access to all participants, no matter how much capital they control. Unfortunately, this is not possible on Ethereum, where transactions fees are often higher than the value of the operation. Synthetic assets platforms are highly sensitive to underlying network performance, since traders on those platforms expect high transaction bandwidth and close to instant execution time. Solana is a high-performance blockchain that is a perfect fit for DeFi applications, including the most demanding, like decentralized exchanges. Applications like Serum or Radium have already proven Solana's usability and started a shift of users to the Solana blockchain. The Synthetify protocol enables creation, exchange and burn of synthetic assets based on prices provided by a decentralized system of oracles. On Synthetify exchange, trading is executed against the public debt pool that allows for almost infinite liquidity and zero slippage even during big trades. Participants of the Deadpool and Prorata exchange fees for acting as counterparties during trades. Deadpool participants need to constantly hold sufficient collateral in Synthetify tokens to ensure platform stability. Now let's talk about four basic features offered by Synthetify. Synthetic assets created on Synthetify exchange will strictly track the price of underlying assets provided by decentralized oracles. All synthetic assets are SPL token based and will act just like all other Solana based tokens. This will enable further usage on other platforms like AMMS with almost frictionless integration. Deadpool participants need to buy synthetic assets to improve their collateralization ratio or to free up collateral. Staking. Users who lock their SNY tokens and mean synthetic assets incurring exchange debt are called stakers. Stakers benefit from trading on Synthetify exchange thanks to accruing pro rata exchange fees from each transaction. All stakers need to maintain a sufficient collateral ratio or part of the collateral can be liquidated to ensure network safety. Collateral is dependent on the price of SNY token and debt is calculated based on their share of debt of the entire platform. Trading. Traders use Synthetify to swap between different synthetic assets. Traders do not need SNY tokens to perform trades, but holding SNY reduces fees charged on asset swaps. Only swaps between synthetic assets are permitted on Synthetify based on current prices provided by the Oracle. Some assets have a limited supply that can be minted. Liquidation. To ensure platform stability, under collateralized stakers can be liquidated and part of the collateral will be transferred to liquidators in exchange for paying back to part of the stakers debt. Liquidation includes penalties of 80% that is transferred to liquidators and 20% to an exchange owned account to improve platform stability. Now let's talk about the SNY token. The token distribution appears on your screen. As you can see, most 30% goes to ecosystem reserves, 20% goes to the team that developed the project, only 1% of the total amount of tokens, or 700,000 tokens, was allocated to IDO. The price per token was $1.5. 
and currently the price per token varies between $1.8. Note that there have been declines in the market. The all-time high for the SNY token was almost $7.5, so as you can see this is an incredible increase compared to the pre-sale price. If you want to purchase synthetify tokens then you can use Ascend Exchange where the SNY token is tradable in pair to USDT. On Ascendex Exchange you will find many other cryptocurrencies that you can purchase. You will also find all the links in the description of this video. In our opinion, Synthetify project is very interesting and offers many interesting options. Share your opinion about Synthetify in the comments below this video. Also let us know if you want to see more videos about project based on the Solana ecosystem. Thanks a lot for watching this video and see you in the next one. Bye!